this was another one that I particularly enjoyed and, and just thought was was fantastic. Um, and this was the Sailmaker's belt. Uh, and we named it that just because of the stitches uh, that you see here on the on the ridge of the belt. Um, these are the kind of stitches, hand stitches that a sailmaker might have uh, down at the clue or the bite um, to uh, to finish things off. Sailmakers obviously use a lot of machines, but at the end of the day, when they wrap some leather around uh, some of their block and some of their tackle, that's all hand stitched, done by hand. Um, so these are two uh, ideas that we brought with us to Portugal uh, to get them started. And uh, I'm going to pick out this one here, uh, the Sailmaker's Belt. And you can see how they've uh, done a terrific job uh, of replicating the, the original belt. Now, a couple things that um, um, I, uh, I, I, wanna, I want them to look at is, um, number one, I don't like the color of the hand. Uh, this is braided uh, nylon. Um, and um, I don't like the color of that. I like this more natural uh, color, so I'm gonna have them uh, go back and take a look at that. Um, I also like this darker, uh, this, this darker color. Um, so, um, you know, appreciate the idea that they have here, um, but definitely uh, gonna be looking at a, at a dark color. The leather itself is, is really, uh, fantastic it's you know you can see here it's a full grain leather it's not split and then uh, you know glued together two pieces to make one uh, none of that um, then let's go ahead and uh, take this off um, let's see what we got here so this is a brushed nickel finish uh, on a hundred percent brass uh brass buckle um really nice uh very similar to the original i actually like it uh like it better than the original uh than the original buckle and then you can see here how the atlantic rancher logo is going to show up um at the end so imagine wearing it like that and that's how the logo will show up so they did a really really nice job uh, on this uh, on this idea, um, I like how the uh, the logo is tucked back in as opposed to here on the end, which is where we had it before. So I think this one is uh, is pretty much ready to go.